My background is in sports medicine. My undergraduate degree is in sports medicine. And for the last 22 years, I've been combining traditional Chinese medicine with sports medicine. And it continues to evolve. What you're going to see today will be a lot of anatomy, a lot of needle techniques and demonstrations, a lot of ideas, a lot of thoughts that I've had that I've put into practice. And I feel like I've refined pretty well. And I want to show this to you. But the things that you learn today, you'll see is very segmentalized. And because we are traditional Chinese medicine practitioners, what I'd like for you to do is to take this information, and you have to. It is imperative that you blend it with TCM differential diagnosis. Tongue, pulse, who is the patient? How well are they ha able to handle the inflammatory process? Do they have spleen chi deficiency, spleen yang deficiency, kidney chi deficiency? What I don't want is to have these techniques that I'm showing you to be the only points that you use. The body must be balanced. So when you see Watu Jaji points being needled and then a few motor points needled, that has to be linked with the channel correspondences. Do you understand? Your techniques, your results will be far greater when you use traditional Chinese medicine with what I'm showing you. So what you're going to hear today will be a blend of Western and TCM. You guys ready? Okay, good. Does anybody need what I just said interpreted? So, uh, Say let me turn slightly. Okay, also guten Morgen erstmal und herzlich willkommen zum Workshop von Matt Callison. Matt ist äh, Licensed Acupuncturist in den USA, macht das seit 24 Jahren, ist vor allem Begründer des Sports Medicine Acupuncture äh, Program. Ähm, neben den, den Theorien der chinesischen Medizin, äh, den Grundlagen, die wir für das Programm brauchen, geht es äh, auch viel um Anatomie und um funktionelle Anatomie in diesem Programm. Das heißt, es ist eine Verbindung von zwei Welten sozusagen. Ähm, heute geht es nicht darum, dass, dass die Punkte, die hier genadelt werden, wirklich die sind, die dann nur behandelt werden, sondern es geht immer darum, das alles zu kombinieren und das im Kontext zu sehen mit der chinesischen Medizin. Also es sind keine Einzeltechniken, sondern es sind Techniken, die integriert werden sollen. Good job, Niels. Yeah. <lacht> Thank you so much. Okay. You can also download the notes through the portal. A couple of days, it was unable to download these notes, but you can now, okay? You can download these notes for those people that did not get the hard copy. Okay, a lot of information, here we go. In this workshop, we'll discuss nerve entrapment syndromes that cause referred pain patterns that include spinal disc degeneration, soft tissue indurations, that compress nerve tissue as it exits or passes through the approximating structures. Now, age-related factors, postural deviations, and or muscle imbalances are associated with nerve entrapment syndromes. 